Please welcome Ringo Starr and his all star this gig. Yeah. As you know, everyone on stage is a star in their own right. We put this together for the summer. And, uh, actually, we've had a lot of tours. We're doing two tours a year now. And you know, it don't come easy. One song ever been written by Lennon McCartney and Starkey. And, uh, you know, we wrote this song and then it was printed up and the credit was printed up. And, uh, you know, you have crazy thoughts on going to myself. You know, those names would look so much better the other way around. But it never happened and it's called What Goes On? What goes on?
some fun? Yeah. You ready to listen to some good music? Yeah. I've got to tell every one of you in the audience this evening, all of you will know at least two numbers. <laughs> and uh, we're going to start the roll with the incredible Edgar Winter. I'd just like to start out by saying what an honor, a privilege, and a pleasure. It's literally a thrill it is to be standing right here on this stage alongside all of these marvelously miraculous, monstrously masterful musicians in the All-Star Band. I love all these guys, and we have so much fun playing one another's music. And that all is, of course, thanks to this gentleman right here. Not only is he the greatest drummer in the greatest band that's ever been, he is that passionate planet-wide purveyor of peace and love. That dashing, daring, dazzling, dynamic doctorate holder and denizen of the drums. That rhapsodic rocking tour of rhythm. Ladies and gentlemen, the revelational, the revolutionary, the radiantly shining and ever rocking Sir Ringo Starr. So, all of that having been said, I have just one more question for you all. Anybody out here ready to take a free ride? Yeah. Turn, Colin. That's it. join that band you keep singing of. And it's called Boys!
Thank you. Very kind. Very loving. Ah. by John. You all know which John I'm talking about. And he says, I think I've got this song for you, it's great. And it's called, I'm the Greatest. And he was actually in the studio when I recorded it, so. Peace and love everybody, because I'm the greatest. <laughs> the first time we've been to this venue. I love this venue. Yeah. Everybody's out in the open, enjoying it. You know, that's what I meant to tell you. You know, you know what the running order is. I thought, you know, we've never been here before. Let's change the running order. I'll do any song you want to do, okay? Doing that one. All that one. I tried, but I'm gonna do it my way now. Just give me the chord. In a town where I was born, lived a man who sailed to sea, and he told us what it's like in the land. So we sailed up to the sun Till we found the sea green And we played beneath the waves In our yellow summer Let me hear you So we all live in a yellow submarine A yellow submarine A yellow submarine We all live Yeah. 
originally playing piano and organ and at a certain point I got really frustrated just fed up being stuck behind a big bank of keyboards uh, you're chained to one spot nobody can see what you're doing say, hey man I want to get out there and boogie so with the invention of the synthesizer I just happened to be the first guy to get the seemingly simple idea of putting a strap on the keyboard, making me the first person in musical history to do this. I wrote the 
this song to feature the synthesizer called Frankenstein. Are y'all ready for the monster? In a laboratory once upon a time at work with a doctor named Frankenstein. Was it musical? Yeah! The yeah. great band I have on stage tonight. I'm going to introduce the band. Let me introduce Colin Hay. Hey, Miss Stewart. Edgar Winter. Steve Lukather. <laughs> Gotta tell you this, holding us all together, Greg Bissonnet. <laughs> anyway, I left you underwater in the Yellow Submarine, and I'm taking you back underwater to a very incredible octopus's garden.
you, Calvin. Time will do. Peace and love. You know, put the lights on. Let me see them. Yeah, baby. Here we go. I love you, <laughs> love you too, man. I love you, Rango. And when I saw it, that's a loud whistle. When I started this, it was all these high voices going, We love you, Ringo. Now, we love you, Ringo. Yeah, things are changing. <laughs> and, uh, you know, when I see you all lit up and you're all looking great in your best T-shirts, uh, you know, I just feel I wish I had a camera so I could take a photograph of all of you.
just, I just got one second to talk to this guy. Here's something like a phone, but it's an incredible screen. What makes it? Here? I mean, look at this. <laughs> Hello? Can you hear me? That's great. Samsung? Can we do a selfie? The title of this next song is something I'm trying to be and do more and more every day. Act naturally. <laughs> Tell you the title of the next song. <laughs> yeah, I love you too, Big Mouth. <laughs> Ring out! Only kidding with you. Okay, I'm not telling you it because if you don't know this song, you're in the wrong venue and you're waiting for Led Zeppelin. <laughs> to be like four seconds long when we started. <laughs> two verses in the chorus. <laughs> All right, well, you know, I truly know where I am today because I am with a little help of my friends. Yeah. 
I want to hold it next. I want to hold it next. Just for 10 seconds. Just just 10 seconds and I'll give it back. Oh, you're you're videoing. Video? <laughs> I'm holding Ringo Style! I'm holding Ringo Style! You did! There we go. Super, super, super. Let's wash it now. No, no, no! <laughs> it's growing. It, it's still going. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Rick. Yeah, man. Good to see you, man.